I have a new plant in the background here that my friend Lauren gave me for my birthday. Let's see how long it lasts in the background before I kill it. Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. My name is Annalise and in today's video we are going to be testing out some more TikTok DIYs and life hacks that are all about fashion. So I love TikTok and I keep seeing all of these really interesting DIYs of like turning one piece of clothing into another piece with just a couple of folds and they look amazing but I'm starting to wonder are these too good to be true? So I thought I would take one for the team and test them out today so that I can give you all the real tea on if these actually work or if they just look good for the camera. So before we get into that, I just wanted to say a quick thank you to you guys because I have been doing a few sponsorships on my channel lately, which is amazing because, you know, it helps to pay the rent, keep my lights on, keep my water running. And I really appreciate your guys' support throughout all of that. You are literally the most amazing subscribers ever and I just love you so much. Also, I wanted to let you guys know that I'm like now a vlogger. I have been vlogging on my vlog channel for the past couple of weeks. I've recently uploaded a Get Ready With Me for a date with a girl where I talk about my dating life and I vlogged my 22nd birthday party. So if that's something you guys are interested in, be sure to subscribe down below because I'm going to a festival this weekend as well and I'm definitely vlogging that. So be sure to subscribe. It's Annalisa's Glam Life. But without further ado, let's get into this video. <laughs> life hack that we're going to test out today is one where you apparently can turn bikini bottoms into a cool fashionable top. Now this looks too good to be true. I feel like, this is just my prediction, but I feel like this is one of those ones where it just looks good for the camera and it's not something you can actually like wear out and about. So I have these gorge pair of bikini bottoms from Meshki. Of course, where else would they be from? My fave brand. Not sponsored. Wish it was Meshki. Hi, how you doing? So anyway, um, I love these. They are pink and they have pearls on them and it would just make a gorge top if this works out, but let's go test it out. I know I said I was going to use these pink meshki bottoms to make a top first, but for this first DIY, I want to actually use these ones because there are two different ways I've seen of wearing a bikini bottom as a top. So every time I say bikini bottom, I think a SpongeBob, but the first way is to wear it as like a halter neck. So I'm pretty sure you just like put your head through the bottom here. I hope this doesn't stretch it. Oof, or rule my makeup. <laughs> You're meant to just put it through like that. Is that right? That can't be right. Surely not. Is this what it's meant to be? Hang on. Let me check the TikTok because this doesn't look right. So this doesn't really work, but let me just take off my crop top and I'll show y'all just how bad it is. This is what I meant when I said sometimes these TikTok life hacks only look good on camera because this doesn't look good. My boobs are literally popping out. So this is definitely a fail. I give it a zero out of 10. It was never going to work and it just, it just didn't. So let's try the second life hack I saw with bikini bottoms. Hopefully this will work a lot better. <laughs> So, in this one, you're creating a halter neck top by putting the bikini straps behind you, like so, and then the other straps you can tie around your neck like a halter neck. Okay, there we go. So, this is meant to be the top. I think, again, the issue is, is that these are just, like, the bikini bottoms are not made long enough to cover anything, but I'm going to take off my crop top and we're just going to see. As you guys probably guessed, this hack, unfortunately, doesn't work either. It looks really cute at the back with all those pearls like that's gorge love it but on the front here because this is made as a bikini bottom it's just way too long if this was a little bit tighter it would be such a cute top but unfortunately it isn't and my boobs keep falling out so this is yet another fail bikini bottoms are just bikini bottoms they don't look good as tops if you really want to wear a different top just wear your bikini top huns it'll look so much cuter than this mess Any heel wearers out there will know it hurts to wear high heels and I've heard of this hack for years but I keep seeing it on TikTok so I was like okay it's time to finally try it and that is where you tape your third and fourth toes together apparently this is meant to stop pain which to me sounded ridiculous until I did some research into it so according to the article that I read the reason that a lot of people find this effective is because when we are wearing shoes obviously all of the pain is on the ball of our feet and so all of the nerves in our toes are in a lot of pain and that causes causes them to be really irritated and to be inflamed. So by taping your third and fourth toe together, you're causing the nerves to be able to relax a little, not have as much pressure on them, and to not be as inflamed, which causes less pain. So these are the most painful heels that I own. I hardly ever wear them because they're so painful, so I thought, 
what a better way to test these out so let's go do it so I've decided the best way to test out this high heel hack is to strap up my feet put on my heels and then wear the heels for the rest of this video so that I can tell you guys what the real tea on this hack is so I've just changed into an outfit for the next life hack so let's just strap up my feet before we do it so I don't have any band-aids to do this life hack with because being an adult is hard and I just don't have any instead I have some Disney washi tape so that is what we are using and I'm a little nervous to show you on my feet because whenever I do high heel videos I get gross foot fetish comments also just a disclaimer my feet aren't the best I mean the reality of wearing high heels all the time is that your feet are always covered in blisters and sores and cuts and scrapes so my feet are covered in those it's just it's the truth that's what happens so anyway let's tape my toes together look at me trying to make this all like aesthetic with the Paris in the background but I've already done this side taping the two toes together so I'm just gonna tape these two together I literally feel so awkward about this because of those foot fetish comments quick little story time y'all one time in my DMs I had a guy offering to buy me Christian Louboutins in exchange for feet pics and I didn't do it because I just felt I don't know, I just didn't want to. And there we go. Okay, let's put my feet into my shoes and see how it feels. Okay, I'm gonna stand up in my shoes that have the like tape on them and let's see how it feels. No pain so far, which I know seems silly. I've just stood up, but no, these feel okay. Let me switch to a wider angle. Okay, so I have the heels on and so far there's no pain at all, which I know sounds silly because I've literally just put the heels on. But usually with these, because it's such an intense arch and it's a stiletto, I'm usually experiencing pain already in these shoes. So it's looking pretty promising that I have no pain in them so far. <laughs> This next life hack is how to turn a bodysuit into a cute little like bow crop top. When I saw this TikTok, my mouth literally dropped. I was like, amazing, what a fantastic idea. And if this works, I'm gonna be doing it all the time because I love bodysuits. I own so many of them. This right now is a bodysuit. And so this would just be such a great way to like upcycle a gorge top. So I thought I'd test it out on this vibrant pink bodysuit so that we can see how this actually works. So let's go do it. So this life hack would be amazing if it works because I specifically love this outfit of this fluoro pink bodysuit and white pants, but you can definitely see the bodysuit through these pants. So let's see if I'm able to turn this into a cute little crop top. So I'm pretty sure you just take the bodysuit out, which always looks a little bit weird. Side note, it's a fear of mine. One day I'm just going to walk around with my tail out no one's gonna tell me but anyway you can just take this tuck it under is that meant to be it surely not where's my phone let me double check okay I have my phone here oh I did do it wrong I did do it wrong okay my bad my bad so I'm gonna wrap it around itself and then tuck it under uh-huh and then you take this wrap that in and tuck it under okay I apologize that was my fault so I'm guessing you just take the end bit like the little bits left over and tuck it in because I can kind of see her doing that in the TikTok and BAM <gasps> stop that's why wait but what do you do at the back me over here like lies what do you do at the back yeah it's at the end of the video and at least it tells you you can just tuck it under or do the same so I might attempt to do the same there we go this totally works and I love this it looks good I'm really happy with this and it's a great way to turn your top into something completely new I wasn't sure if it was gonna work on this specific color just because the inside is different but it works and I think this looks good not sure about the back I'm sure editing Annalise will tell you now if I like it or not but the front I love so much and I think this is a great hack I'm gonna give this an 8 out of 10 would be 10 but the back is a little bit difficult to do but I would definitely wear this out and I'm sure you're gonna see me doing it on my Instagram real soon I now have these heels on for 20 minutes with my toes taped up and I am honestly shocked at this hack because usually by now in these shoes I would be starting to do the move where you know you stand with your weight on one foot to give your other foot a break and then you swap over to the other that way the balls of your feet are getting a bit of a break but I'm not needing to do that and I don't know what sort of witchcraft this is but it is working <laughs> obsessed with fashion videos on TikTok or you love looking at like outfits on Pinterest you would have seen these sorts of skirts where they have the gorgeous little like belly button hole in them but these are always so expensive and they're just such a trendy piece that I personally haven't bought any so when I saw this life hack about turning a tank top into that skirt my mind was blown so I have this gorge fluffy pink top that I'm really excited to try out and see if I'm gonna have a super trendy skirt okay so as you can see I have my tank 
tank top on so the first thing I wanted to measure is is this even long enough to make a skirt and the answer is yes it definitely is so I'm just gonna go off camera quickly take this off do the crisscross thing and see how it works so BRB so this doesn't work I ripped a lot of stitches trying to get this skirt on with the sleeves on the side it doesn't look right on the front here like the hole is way too big and the biggest problem of all is the oh well I've ripped it oh my god I ripped it okay that was not <laughs> didn't expect to see that when I turned to the side I was actually talking about how the bit of fabric sticks out so much here but wow I literally ripped my tank top girding this on awesome thanks TikTok and on the back as well no one talks about what you're meant to do with the back and it just looks so weird like it just this doesn't work this does not work at all it doesn't look cute and I hate it so zero out of ten don't do it but whilst I'm in this funky skirt, let's do a high heel update. If you're wondering, yes, every time I'm doing this, I am taking that coat rack outside. But the shoes are finally starting to hurt. It's probably been about 45 minutes to an hour now. And usually I would be sitting in these shoes by now. Like they hurt my feet a lot. So it's only starting to hurt in my left foot, which tends to be my weaker foot. My right is still doing totally fine, which after 40 minutes, crazy unheard of like that normally wouldn't happen at all normally by now both feet are in pain and i'm having to sit down so this is going really well i need to get the skirt off i can't take myself seriously my pack is all about how to hide your bra straps when wearing a halter neck top so i have this top here that i absolutely love you guys might remember it from my Shein haul it was actually meant to go with this outfit but it's a bit cold today but anyway not the point um i love this but because i'm a part of the small boobs community i need to wear a bra with clothes which i know you usually think it's the opposite but i rely on my push-up bras to you know push up so if i have to wear something like this where i can't wear a bra because the bra straps will show i just don't wear it so i really hope that this life hack works because i think it could be a life changing so let's go try it. okay so this is the top on and i have my bra here so the tiktok says to undo the straps on the back and to hook them together which honestly makes a lot of sense to me i really think that this is going to work and also i'm just going to mention it i always get a lot of questions about what bras i wear i know that probably sounds so random but i do because as i said small chested and i always wear push-ups so this is my go-to bra this brand it is the victoria secret pink t-shirt push-up bra i'll try and link it below for you guys but yeah this is what i am always wearing so then now that these straps are undone it says to hook them together there we go now that they are hooked together i'm just gonna put it on and tie it like do it up at the back that way i can get the right size going on okay so i've had to put these as tight as possible and that is finally tight enough so obviously it looks a little weird you're not meant to wear it over the top obviously so i'm just going to quickly put the bra on properly and let's see if you can see the straps you guys this hack is amazing the bra is on and as you can see you can't see the straps at all they're not sticking out the back either no so this is the front and this is the back and this works so well it's such a simple hack i don't know why i've never thought to do it myself <laughs> This next life hack is never really something I've had an issue with, but I know a lot of other people do because people are always going on about how they need a man in their life because they need someone to do up their necklaces or undo their dresses or apply fake tan on their backs. And I've never understood this because I am able to do all of those things by myself. And I was always like, I don't understand the issue. Why can't people just do up their own dresses? I realized today that I have long arms. That's why putting on my own fake tan has never been an issue. Doing up my own dresses, totally fine. My hands and arms can reach it. But apparently everyone else is not blessed with long arms like me. So I wanted to try out this life hack where you use a coat hanger to zip up your dress because it's also quite genius if this actually does work. And I think it's so funny because I used to be so insecure about my long arms, but they actually serve a purpose. So to test out this life hack, I have my favorite dress on and this is from Meshki, of course, my faves. This video is not sponsored by them. It seems like it is. I wish it was, but it's not. But I have it undone, as you can see on the sides here, and I have the coat hanger already threaded through the zipper because for this to work you need to thread it in first and then pull it up because trying to you know get a heart coat hanger through the zipper hole from the back it'd be much easier to just do up the dress so i'm gonna turn around and let's test this out i'm kind of worried that this is gonna pull on the zipper and like rip it off i'll be gutted if that happens i've already lost a singlet to this video i don't want to lose the zipper of this dress so let's see Oh, it's working. Okay, I think the girl then used 
this to pull on. Oh my god, why is this so hard? In the video, it looked so easy. I feel like a crazy person. Okay, I'm giving up. This, this doesn't work. As you can see, I've ruined this coat hanger and I was only able to get my dress up this high. And to show y'all that it's not the zipper, look at how easy it is to zip this. Boom. Easy. So, that doesn't work. Unfortunately, if you don't have long arms like me, the coat hanger hack does not work. Zero out of ten. Anyway, this is the final update on the heels. It is the end of the video. And I started filming this video at 11 p.m. So, and it's now 12.50, as you can see. So, 12.50, I started at 11. Oh, do you like my background, by the way? Ariana Grande. Oh, we love it. So, I have had these heels on for an hour and 50 minutes. And I am in shock at how well this hack works. My feet hurt like they do hurt a little bit but nowhere near the amount of pain that i would normally experience wearing these heels standing for almost two hours my feet are in a little bit of pain but not the amount of pain that they would normally be in after wearing these shoes and standing in them and walking around in them for almost two hours it's incredible and this life hack life-changing i i cannot say enough good things about it. and those are all of the fashion life hacks that we are testing in today's video be sure to let me know down below if you guys would like to see an entire video dedicated to high heel life hacks from tiktok because i can definitely do that too there's a lot on there that also sound too good to be true so we can test those out too if y'all are interested but be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel because i upload new videos every single week also be sure to follow me on tiktok instagram and all that good stuff and of course subscribe to my vlog channel because as as I said, I have been vlogging on that a lot lately. I love you guys so, so much, and I can't wait to see you in my next video. Bye. Mwah.